Hey, I'm Andrew Weiner, New York historian. I know this city like I know the back of my hand. Every nook, every cranny, every bench. <laughs> We're here in iconic Central Park, right in the approximate center of Manhattan. It was built in 1858 by Frederick Law Olmsted, and even though this was the first park he designed and erected, he would go on to design and build dozens of other parks in at least nine other states and parts of Canada, earning him the coveted title King of Parks. Olmsted loved parks so much that if he had had his way, he'd have turned the entirety of North America into one giant park for the rest of the world to come and visit. Luckily for us, parks cost money. There's so much history in this park that we're gonna have to narrow our focus to this bench. Now this bench may not look like much. In fact, it looks like every other bench here in the city. No battle was fought here, there was no rally here, no famous person ever sat on this bench. But this bench is special. It was placed here in honor of the bench that sat here prior to its construction. That bench was built in 1860, two years after the completion of the park. It lived through the Civil War, World Wars I and II, the Cold War, and Vietnam, though it never saw any action. It lived through the entirety of the 20th century without ever once interacting with history. It sat in this spot for just over 130 years, until, in 1991, rotting away and uncared for, it was torn down by the Central Park Conservancy in a bid to re-beautify the park. This bench was placed here three years later in its honor. I'm Andrew Weiner, New York historian. Damn it! Ha 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 ha!